This video is the second video of a webinar funnel series and in this tutorial we're going to focus more on the automated or the evergreen approach of webinars. So webinar you're going on for a live webinar approach or the replay approach they are both incredibly powerful resources to utilize. So if you wanted to um, build a replay funnel and you wanted to launch some new content, a uh, content writing course or yoga teaching or you wanted to use it for a sales approach where a uh, an automated webinar could be selling for you pretty much 24 hours a day seven days a week either way it's incredibly powerful and something that all marketers should really be utilizing so what i've done from going into your admin uh, side is i've set up a lead magnet funnel automatically it gave me a theme with two pages so i cloned the initial thank you page just by pressing on the clone step here. So it gives me a three page option. And I've named it opt-in page, the waiting room, and the webinar replay itself. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with the opt-in page. As always, very, very, very simple. Um, you would obviously be wanting to make this as comprehensive as possible. Uh, so here I'm gonna be launching a new training with five new yoga poses. Um, so of course, it's, it's already populated the form. They would put their name and email address and press the teach me now button, okay? At that point, we then take them through to the waiting room, okay? And this is page two. So on here, again, very simple, uh, sweet. Thank you for requesting to watch my special yoga training. And what I would probably suggest at this point is to give them some sort of countdown timer to show them when the webinar is going to be replaying. So it's gonna be going live for them in principle. So on the countdown timer, I'd press settings, okay? And we've got the timer settings section here. It's a timer and it's an evergreen. And the way that our system is set up at the moment is that I would suggest for you to run every 15 minutes, okay? And that will kick off, that will play live 15 minutes from the time that they click onto your page, okay? So now what we wanna do is add in some more action, some more call to action. So when the uh, timer expires, okay, we're gonna be wanting to redirect them to a URL. So at this point, I'm wanting to um, copy and paste the webinar replay URL, and I'm then gonna paste in the webinar replay into there. Okay, and then saving it as always up here. We'll then be taking them through once the 15 minutes is up and it hits on zero, it will then be taking them through to the third page, this page here, which is the webinar uh, replay itself. Now, of course, you're gonna be wanting to make this as um, attractive as possible. Um, so adding in content, um, you've got the replay here. Uh, you could be adding in all sorts of uh, future steps, taking them through to another page where they could call up, uh, book a call with you. Um, there are so many things you can do um, to this, this type of funnel. I've just done a very, very simple three page template, the opt-in page, then the waiting room, and then taking them through to the um, uh, replay itself on the third page. And also remember, on the waiting room, they've got 15 minutes. Um, by all means, uh, you could possibly include a, a video here, just uh, introducing yourself, taking them through a bit more details of what they're gonna be um, uh, seeing over the coming time in the replay. 